There it is. There we go. There it is. Hope. Oh, there it is. It does look giant. In fact, I was reading it and it said that it is on average 87 what? something thousand square feet bigger than most Costco. Heyo and welcome to the vlog this morning. Hi guys, we're back. Good to see you guys. Little Rocky, he wants to say good morning or good hi. Good hi. Hi buddy. <laughs> Good, good hi, hi everybody. Good hi. Look at this cool little toy pin we got set up for him. Gives mom a little bit more of a yeah. peace of mind. Can I tell you what happened? I set him down. I come to help one of the kids. I turn around. He's gone. None of us can find him. Me, Beckham, JD, Peyton. We're all like searching the entire house. There's stairs right there. We are freaking out. He went inside the curtain. Inside over there. I can't I'm do this. Just right over there. I was like, we gotta get a playpen. We got a playpen. Thanks to Uncle Gallon and Aunt Hannah. Got a fun vlog today. Oh my gosh. We are going to the world's largest Costco. To do a back to school haul for the kids lunch. Yep. I'm really excited. I'm excited to go to the That's like I hear it is huge. Costco's already big. I did not surely why, why they're making it triple the size of a regular Costco. It's like Costco. their headquarters, I heard. It is here in Salt Lake City, so we are gonna go. The kids are still with Grandma and Grandpa, which has been so glorious and so nice. So we're gonna go do some school clothes shopping and go check out the world's largest Costco. It is a balmy 100 degrees here in Salt Lake City as we are pulling in. I can just feel it. Turn down the AC to talk to you guys, so we're gonna do this fast. We are just pulling into the world's largest Costco, do a back to school grocery shopping haul before we pick up our kids from Grandma and Grandpa. We have never been here. How did we not even know this existed? I'm really excited. Hasta la vista. I want to, want to know from you guys, who has been to a Costco? I know it's not just in America, but like, okay, tell me two things. If you live in America, have you been to Costco? If you live outside of America, have you been to Costco? Does your country have one? I don't know all those types of things because I see a lot of like Costco grocery shopping hauls and then I'm like, that mean nothing to some of you. So for those of you it doesn't mean as much for, Costco is like a wholesale buy in bulk. They have the coolest things and I'm really excited to go experience it with you guys today. There it is. There we go. There it is. Oh, there it is. It does look giant. In fact, I was reading it and it said that it is on average 87 what? something thousand square feet bigger than most Costco. 87,000 more. 87,000 more square feet in this Costco. Holy moly. I'm excited to experience that. 87,000 square feet. Are you excited? He's excited. Costco, Costco. The world's biggest Costco. Man, you come right in the door and they hit you with the big ones. Wow, I feel like I'm there. If I go like this, do you guys think that the we're nest? there? The do you guys feel like we are there together oh, right now? Gosh. Wow, that is actually really, really nice. Wow, clothing section. Wow, wow. It's called French toast, short sleeve polo. Guys, one time I tried on a pair of pants like this, I bought them, came home and asked you if you liked them. Remember what you said to me? No, I don't. Was it something mean? Yeah. Oh, man. You said that I looked like I was wearing a garbage bag. <laughs> so I returned them. Were they black? Yeah. That's awesome. No. Yeah, that's really funny. The worst. I am the best. All right, our main purpose here today is to get stuff for back to school shopping. So we need to get stuff for lunches. Beckham will not, I repeat, he will not eat the lunch. He is so picky. But Peyton will. She's about 50 50. We need to get some good stuff so that we're not stressing in the morning. I don't need the stress of trying to find what they'll eat last minute. So we're going to make sure that we are getting some good stuff so that they can really help make their own lunches and make it enjoyable. The item on the docket is going to be emergencies. These are so good for your kids to take when you get back to school because they're going to be exposed to so many germs they haven't had all summer and all last year because they were wearing masks. So we're gonna have them take emergencies every night to kind of help keep them healthy. Also, you guys, my kids take elderberries. Anybody take elderberry? It's like an immunity thing. And I swear, I really do think they work. I swear they never yeah. like if they haven't, they get sick. But also, like we're not really around a lot of people, but elderberries are also a must-have on your list. Perks of being at the world's largest Costco. We found this brand. It is a little bit cheaper, but it's not the money. They have a lemon lime, and my kids don't really like the tangerine. So on these ones, it has super orange and tangerine. They really only like the raspberry. So I'm gonna actually try this brand and see if my kids like the lemon lime flavor. It might be like a Sprite. I bet they like it. It'll seem carbonated. Yeah, yeah, it'll seem like carbonated. Like, yeah, yeah I'm actually really excited. It'll be like Sprite. All right, you guys, round three. We have now switched. We do not have all these options at our Costco's, but at this one, there is a complete immunity. So now we are scrapping it, going with the third option. This one has zinc, vitamin D, 
it'll and have, vitamin C. Uh, the lime, lemon lime now. It's it doesn't have lemon lime, lime but it has lime. zinc. I feel like this is like an anti-COVID. It is. The zinc and the vitamin D really are like the main things that will Yeah, I'm feeling good, good about this. Sugar free, we're trying it. We're gonna buy, should we get both of them or just this one? Let's just try these ones. I'm feeling good about it. These are so good when you're dehydrated. Here's a little tip. Make sure you drink them in like a 40 ounce water bottle, at least a 32 ounce water bottle because boy oh boy are they salty if not. And make sure it's cold. Ooh, and have you guys tried these zip fizzes? These are so good. <laughs> My husband, ladies and gentlemen, he likes it. Is that fun? Is that fun, baby? We're gonna be getting a couple boxes of these. They're not on our back to school list, but we're gonna give them to the kids' teachers so that they can like reward the class sometimes. You wanna get on a teacher's good side. You show up to back to school night with fruit snack that they can give their class, that'll do it for you. So I think I'm gonna do these. My kids love these, and so if they could just put one in their lunch as like their after lunch snack. I love that it's not a lot of sugar and it's not gonna make them hyper. It's only like mm, 5.39. But look at that, then they can pack one. They will be thrilled. Clubbing is back. This is like my favorite part of coming to Costco is all the goodies that they have on the little booths. They have these sweetest ladies just handing out the goodies, all the things that I love. And now I got, I got jerky. I'm just eating around, walking around with Michelle, getting all the good things and eating at the same time. Two of my favorite things. Rocky loves the clubbing, huh? You love the clubbing too? Going after my chocolate covered cinnamon bears, huh? Don't you even think about it, boy. Yeah. We're in the freezer. Bundle up, buttercup. Oh, he's like, why is it so cold in here? Can't stay in here long, buddy. Who turned off the sun? Oh my gosh, it really is cold. I want to take like a coat from the clothing area and put on a hat and come in here. I can see my breath. Oh, he's, okay, his hurry. forehead's cold. Here. It's so cold in there. Glad to be leaving. Bye. This is something that you don't see normally at any Costco. Holy cow, look at this. Bone in lamb, bone in lamb. These are lambs hanging here. I feel like I want to be like Rocky and just like give it a couple of uh, good punches. Yep, only at the world's biggest Costco. Love you. So strong. I should be getting those big things. I'm back. <laughs> Gotta give you one more. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> the question I have for people that like LaCroix, have you literally tried any other drink? <laughs> it's not good. It is not good. It's an acquired taste. No, it's not good. Number one back to school need in these times. Why? What is that for? for? being really crappy. Tomorrow's vlog is going to be, dad doesn't even know this. Maybe we should get his reaction Whoa. with it. Dad is gonna be pregnant all day tomorrow. So we actually need to go pick out a watermelon right now for that event tomorrow. Okay, that sounds awesome. Oh, you're gonna pick me out a watermelon, huh? Maybe what about Which the small one, one right there? Which one? Let's well, just one do like the, that's perfect right there, yeah, like okay. one of those. It looks about the size of him. Oh no, we must go bigger. It's not even the size of your head. Must go bigger? What? No, 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 no. How about a cantaloupe? Cantaloupe is good size. I it's did not birth size. a cantaloupe. I birthed a watermelon four times. <laughs> Found a steal of a deal. I don't know if this is right. But I, I think it's a typo. Just gonna run with it. Six cents per There's cup. There's no way. Look, like Six the standard oranges. Standard oranges, 12 cents. Almost double the... I don't think that's right, but I'm just gonna go with it, okay? Is it expired? How could you do that here? Be. Running yeah, out of room amazing. in our car, Daddy. Six cents. Rightfully so. Look at the comparison between how many are here and how many are right here. Yeah, well, everybody's like, ah, I wonder that's if That's a cool. steal. Rocko, 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 rocko. Rocko, 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 rocko. Rocko, 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 rocko. Dad's hard at work, loading up our Costco haul. Oh yeah. It's looking good, baby. Made out like a banshee. The kids are gonna be like, why did you get so many packs of pears? They were a good deal, son. They were a good deal. Well, after being stuck in traffic for an hour and a half, we are to my brother and sister-in-law's house to get our kids. And I am so excited to meet Grandma and Grandpa here and get them. We go see Bubba and Sissy. Guess yeah. what Peyton's here. Let's go. Bye bye, sissy. I need you. No one's home. <gasps> okay, we'll go home. Oh, yeah. Yeah.
We are home and we are putting away, and by we I mean my amazing husband, is putting away all of our giant Costco haul. And do you know what, Peyton? I went to Target and I found some of the cutest clothes for you. So cute. I saw the backpack and I was She did really see cute. the backpack. But a lot of your clothes won't come till Monday. So Monday when they come in the mail, we are going to do a fashion show for everybody. I'm gonna go ahead and show Peyton her stuff now and then you guys are gonna have to wait till Monday for our official fashion show. I got this because this year you get to start bringing lunches. How do you feel about hamburgers for lunch? Would that be a good idea? Yes. Yes, don't open them yet though. No, these are for school lunch treats. Aww. I know, right? Got a bloody nose. Go wash your face, cutie. Okay, we are home and it is time to roast marshmallows. Well, actually, okay, I forget. We gotta eat dinner first. Can't have our dessert before we have actually our dinner. What? It's the moon! Just eating over there in the lawn, huh? Palmer's got her mac and cheese and Beckham's got his corn dog. Beckham is obsessed with 500. The game 500, so I've been throwing it up on top of the roof and it rolls down and we catch it right over here. I don't know if you guys saw on Instagram, but we have been playing a lot of 500 lately. It is honestly his favorite game. And it is my favorite game too, like I, I love it. I'm sure you guys play 500 before. Like that is the childhood game that you always play. Okay, so the fire is up, we're ready. Let's roast some marshmallows, let's roast some hot Hot dogs. It's gonna be a fun night. We are wrapping up summer. This is kind of our like last of summer activity that we have going on. I'm kind of bummed. I'm excited for the kids to get back to school and experiences and stuff, but we're really gonna miss these guys. They are just like my little pals. First off, we gotta clean off the sticks, right? Put them up in the fire. For those who uh, don't know and who don't do much camping, mom has got hot dogs out right, getting ready. Beckham wants to show you guys his awesome trick on the tramp. Okay, okay. Whoa, dude. If you can do the front handspring, try that. Okay, all right, then, nice work, nice work. Ooh, I like that, nice job. Tonight, it is like the end of school it is really sad to see things come to an end, but everything good comes to an end and then you can just start all over. I'm excited for the kids to go back to school. Kids are excited to go back to school. Also, it was fun to go to Costco with you guys and to just see the world's biggest Costco. The place was huge. It just kept going and going and going <laughs> and we definitely got a lot of good stuff. What are your favorite things to get at Costco? What other things should we put in our Costco halls or also into our kids' lunches? What do you guys love to put in your school lunches? Thank you guys for watching. Tomorrow, apparently, I get pregnant. So uh, you're not going to want to miss that vlog. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye.